You're testing urgent. What was so important? Bro, I said I forget to tell you something. Would I forget if it were that important? Anyways, I am here now. Lay it on me. Remember that guy, Dakbo? The one that took her? Exactly! What's up? More money? On the contrary, he has been disturbing me for months that he need you to send a document saying we are waiving all rights to the child and also a non-disclosure agreement for our dealings together. I don't understand. What does he think we meant by changing the birth certificate? According to the document, he's trying to avoid DNA suit in the future. Is that guy like bro? My bro, I thought so too, until he drove a Benz to bring me this document last night. You think he stole the car? I don't think so. He also dressed very nice. If that's what he wants, I will sign. It's not like I can undo this whole thing. Moreover, an ND will also protect me. Are you sure you don't want to go over this with your lawyer? Hell no. Where is the one pain? It's been a minute. Yeah, I know. Sorry I haven't been taking your calls. I have my reasons. No, it's okay. It's not okay. I blamed you for Molara. I thought if you had just stayed away, she would still be with me. That is so unfair because she was your daughter too. So what brings you by today? To say that I am sorry. Don't be sorry. I sometimes blame myself too. As parents, it's our job to protect our children. We Let me stop you right there. You are not the wicked is around truck driver. And you were unconscious. You couldn't have rescued a baby in that state. You got out. You have a second chance. And I'm happy for you. Thank you, BC. It means a lot to me. Sure. You're welcome. If you don't mind me asking, what brought all this now? I have been on a journey. A cleansing one. And I have been making progress. I'm happy for you. Even your mom stopped sending me those verses. Sure she figured I was beyond saving. Nope, I deleted your number from my phone. Jeez, thank you. You're welcome. But why do? I did that because I want a fresh start. I didn't want you and mommy speaking, especially since I'm not going to be around anymore. You are kind of a trigger for her. Not going to be around? Yes, I am moving to London next week, so this is probably the last time you hear from me. Oh my god, are you serious? I am, I need the change. Lucky you, I wish you the best. Thank you for informing me. That is why I came here. I will get out of your hair. Ah, Daddy Kemi. You are back. Welcome. What is going on here? The girls are trying on their new dresses. It's no. Carry Binta and you all should go upstairs to your room. Ah, come and take your dresses. So, did the contractors pay? They paid yesterday. I told you. But you were already asleep when I saw the alert. So what is the important thing you want to say? I did not want the girls to hear this, but your treatment of Binta is cruel. How? She eats? She goes to school? What is the problem? Why didn't you buy her dresses today? They didn't have a size in the store. Mommy Kemi, that girl is our daughter. Or at least she's mine. Please, treat her like a member of this family. But she's not a member of the family. She has her own mother and I have my own daughters too. I don't think I can do more for her than I'm already doing. Please try, Mommy Kemi. Fine, I will try. Thank you. Should I bring your food now? Yes, please. Bro, how long has it been? Man, I think it's been like four months. We haven't seen each other since after New Year. You have been busy now. My brother, I'm around for the next month though. Oh, cool. Cool? Nonsense. What's new? Busy came by the office today. 
Bro, I just came back now. Start small. <laughs> <laughs> She's relocating to London, man. Wow. How do you feel, man? I feel sad. I feel like I've taken too much from her. I feel guilty. Like a damn coward that destroyed her life. I feel jealous. She has the guts to choose peace above all else. Hmm, that last part. I take it as therapy has not been going well. Ro and I are struggling, man. Sometimes I feel like, if not for the kids, we would be done by now. Sorry, bro. It's fine, man. Busy said sorry to me. Are you serious? Yeah, she said she blamed me and she feels bad that she did. Oh, that's sad. I cried after she left, man. If only she knew. On the plus side, with busy relocating, there has to be a relief among these feelings though, right? Well, I guess. Anyways, enough about me. What's up with you? Bro, I met a girl. You did not tell me this on phone. Just boring gist about your work. First of all, we need the proper drinks. I'm not drinking this your poor liquor choice. Sorry, you rich man. We did not get government contracts. <laughs> 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 drinks are on you. <laughs> drinks on me. Good afternoon, mommy. Come and sit with me a bit. Mommy, you have been so clingy since this week started. Ha! My daughter is going to London, and I will not be seeing you for a while. But you can always visit. Uh, it won't be the same, my dear. Mommy! Just stay here. You're still my baby. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, I will stay. Thank you. I went to see Shagun today, mommy. I told him I was leaving for London next week. But you are leaving tomorrow. I just didn't want to disclose when, mommy. That is fine, my dear. Mommy. Yes? Thank you for all you do. That is my job, dear. Now let's go inside so you can eat your food. Look at you. You didn't want to hug me and now you are smothering me. Why did you cook, mommy? Look how beans. Ah, mommy, I will miss your food very much. Only my food? I will miss you, mommy. I will miss you more. Come eat before the food gets cold. Okay, mommy. Your test seemed urgent. What was so important? Bro, I said I forget to tell you something. Would I forget if it was that important? Anyways, I am here now. Lay it on me. Remember that guy, Dakbo? The one that took her? Exactly! What's up? More money? On the contrary, he has been disturbing me for months that he need you to sign a document saying we are waiving all rights to the child and also a non-disclosure agreement for our dealings together. I don't understand. What does he think we meant by changing the birth certificate? According to the document, he's trying to avoid the any suit in the future. Is that guy like broke? My bro, I thought so too, until he drove a Benz to bring me this document last night. You think he stole the car? I don't think so. He also dressed very nice. If that's what he wants, I will sign. It's not like I can undo this whole thing. Moreover, an ND will also protect me. Are you sure you don't want to go over this with your lawyer? Hell no. Raya is the one paying for his retainer. He will report to her. I will sign the document. It's fine. I will go get it, man. You are not going to read it first. Did you read it? I did. Then it's fine. Hey, can I please sleep here? Trouble at home? Yeah. Good afternoon. I will really miss this old boisterous city. London is not tranquil, my dear. Mommy, you're ruining my moment here. Madam, you must go now because of traffic. Oga, please wait. Madam, my traffic are they look. Oga, calm down. My flight is by 12 p.m. No traffic can make me late. Alright, madam. I feel so bad, mommy. Why? Last night, I had a dream. I saw Lara. She was smiling 
she was happy, mommy. Because she has gone to a better place. I want you to embrace this new experience. Learn, make friends, try new things. Maybe you will even find a good man here and give marriage a shot. I really don't know about marriage. But your other thing sounds good. I wonder if they sell correct local beans there. Ah, mommy, I will so miss your food. Try Oyimbo dishes. Oh, you mean British dishes? <laughs> See, you're already talking like them. I should go now, mommy. God will protect you and keep you safe. Amen. Call me when you get to the airport. I will call you from the airport when I land and when I get to the hotel. Promise. <laughs> bye bye. Sir, I. I already told you to move all my meetings. But, sir, what I want? Look, Patricia, I have a lot on my plate. Can you handle things like I employed you to do? Sir, what I am trying to tell you is that. The chairman and two other members of the board are waiting for you. Did, did you tell, tell them that I'm away? I told them that you were in a meeting, sir. They insisted they would wait to see you. How long did you tell them my meeting was for? About one hour. <laughs> so you only bought me one hour? What kind of secretary are you? With all due respect, sir, I'm a very good secretary. We have had 15 of our staff resigned in the last one week. I have been all salaries for six months. And I still come here every day and do my job. Patricia. Yes, sir. Can you inform the chairman and the other two gentlemen that I will be with them shortly? Okay, sir. After you're done with that, you can clean out your decks. You no longer work here. Effective immediately. The office will send you a check for the salaries owed and other severance benefits. Now, that will be all. Madam, try is mine now. They come out from Ninja. You suppose they are P. Who told you that I am sad? Madam, no be so your face be now. I see as you they follow your mama the love just now. Please just turn on the radio. Ah, madam, obviously I know you. <sighs> now now you come. <laughs> 